bitcoins uh, nimesikia tu recent, recently uh-huh. sikuiske kitambo but nimesikia recently no i don't believe it's real it sounds more of a scam to me i've ever sent someone the link but i tried it myself and it didn't work j ni kipi haswa kinachogonga kwenye bongo lako punde tu unaposikia jina bitcoins Bitcoin ama pesa hewa ni sarafu ya kawaida ambayo hutumia mfumo wa kidijitali kufanya malipo ambapo mapatano hufanyika moja kwa moja kati ya watumizi bila mapatanishi kama vile benki kuu. Hii ina maana kwamba Bitcoin ndio mfumo wa kwanza kutumia malipo ya kidijitali yasiyodhibitiwa. Katika heka heka zetu kuielewa teknolojia iliyotumika kutengeneza sarafu ya Bitcoin tulielekea katika eneo la kibiashara ya Chandaria ambapo tulikutana na Frank Dea mwanabiashara mkakamavu na ambaye ndiye mwanzilishi haswa wa huduma ya Bitsoko ambayo ni kama ile huduma ya Mpesa. Basically Bitsoko is a blockchain company that is trying to drive the adoption of digital currency bitcoin is um, an alternative means of in of, of transacting one bitcoin is about 2500 usd though the figure keeps fluctuating biashara mpya ya masoko ya bitcoin zinaendelea kuongezeka katika harakati za kuelimisha umma kuhusiana na mfumo huu wa kisasa wa kufanya malipo One of the key reasons is awareness. People still don't know. So a majority of people are still trying to get a grasp of what it is and how it works. Secondly, it's because merchants have not been able to adopt it. The, the merchant network could be an ideal opportunity to get people to start to utilize it in their day-to-day transactions. And thirdly, um particularly for Kenya and Africa, It has to do with the, the internet penetration because it's done electronically. Ununuzi wa bitcoins kupitia Bitsoko ni mchakato rahisi ambao hugarimu asilimia tatu ya ada ya huduma huku biashara mpya za bitcoins barani Afrika zikiuza sarafu hizi kwa walio na hamu ambao huwasilisha jukumu muhimu katika kutangaza uwepo wa sarafu hizi. Soko is a point of sale that is developed to enable um, merchants from and merchants can be anyone who's involved in any sort of trade whether online or offline. Swali muhimu ambalo wa Kenya wengi wanajiuliza ni je, ni vipi utapata faida kutokana na sarafu ya Bitcoins? All these transactions can be done at no cost and our revenue comes from a different stream also this transaction is not limited to between me and you here kama vile anavyotuelezea bitcoin inapitia changamoto kuota mizizi humu barani na haswa nchini Kenya we have developed products and and services offering services that are able to get people to know what it is um, how they can get it how they can be able to transact from the kawaida mamboga to your shopping mall experience to your restaurant paying your bill you can be able to do that through bitcoin masoko mapya yapo tayari kwa mifumo mipya ya malipo ya kidijitali kama vile bitcoins na kuna uwezekano wa sarafu hii geni kuwa ushindani mkubwa na dhahabu ya kunganganiwa katika bara la Afrika. Jesse Rogers, KUTV.